Hello everyone, I'm Nordic Beast and welcome to the NID server. So sorry I'm getting low frame rates, there is a lot in here, even with my graphics turned down. Um, as you can see we have a lot here. So I just um, I just recently started my own little base in here. There's not much going on so far. I'll probably build something bigger elsewhere later. But there's not much uh, free room at the moment. They're talking about adding a um, a new asteroid for me, for me to hop onto. But uh, this one, I believe, has some of Zek's stuff outside of it. But there's nothing really built inside, so it just took a little room here for now. Uh, build up some resources, and I'll build a ship so when I do have some place I can go stay, I can just grind all this down and take it with me. And I'll just have a nice ship parked out here. I will say, I, I do like this skybox, but I feel like I'm going to crash. I feel like <laughs> I'm just in a stratosphere and not quite into orbit yet. So, i give a little tour of what I've got so far. It's not much, but I've got this terrible little drill ship. Um, I mistakenly put uh, this collector on the front. Originally, it was pointed out front or, you know, with the collector out forward, because I thought I had a big, one of these, um, I guess, big cargo doors here. I thought it was on the, the back side, so I had it facing um, my cargo container. Now, I could redesign it, but I didn't have much time, so basically I just took it off and flipped it upward. And, I mean, it still collects, but not as well as I'd like. Uh, and there's not nearly enough thrusters on here, but I was working with very limited materials at the time. I was just starting. All I had was a respawn ship, and this is what I made with it so far. Um, oh, and I found one, uh, like an abandoned um, beacon, so I ground that down and took it. And this is, as you notice, pretty much everything here other than steel plates is what you would find on... Uh, regular respawn ship. So this is all I've got so far. Um, I don't know. I may I may just keep this here and keep it as my winter retreat. <laughs> you know, eventually once I build up a, a nice base, I'll just clear this out and I'll make this my home. Uh, put some nice decorations in here. As you see, oh oh, getting a bit of lag. Sorry about that. There we go. They have a lot of mods in here. A lot. A lot to play with. So I'm looking forward to once I have enough resources, I can actually decorate a bit. Um, so another thing Dracul put me on was using blast doors as landing pads as opposed to the heavy armor. Because heavy armor deforms, blast doors do not. They cost pretty much the same, and these things are very heavy duty against thrusters. And I kind of like the look. I like the seam that it gives. It gives the idea that it's a landing pad, which I need to color this. So, and this isn't the best design I've ever gone for for a base. I don't know. I just I didn't I didn't know if Zach had claimed this or not. Even though there's uh, the only thing I found here was a partially started base that looked long abandoned. Like there there wasn't even any. You know, Sorry about if my frame rates drop here, guys. I really am. Uh, oh, there's a random floating part. Just a oh, white block. I have it. Take that. So as you see, there's... <laughs> oh, it's so laggy. Now, like I said, I think this is X ship as well. I don't know, I haven't really got to do anything with anyone in here yet but build my base. But I really like this design. I think this is really neat. Uh, is there gravity? Nope. But I, I like how it's open underneath with all the cargo containers. I just, aesthetically, that's that's really cool. And with all these, uh, with all these ramps. Or I don't know, it, it looks either half built or half taken apart. It's kind of hard to tell. <clears throat> Pardon me. And, uh, go up here. Ah, get in there. Come on. There we go. 
I like this, uh, I like this bridge. So I do know for a fact that that platform is Zex. So, again with the ship, I, I don't know, can I get in there? Yeah? Whose is it? Oh, this is also Zek, so. Yeah. Uh, watching previous videos, I noticed that there was a lot of, like, abandoned equipment on the server, but unfortunately I can't seem to find all that much that's honestly abandoned. Otherwise, I just scavenge like crazy. Now, <laughs> this is probably my next step, is doing something like what Zek has done here, or... Uh, or how Boris now has the Phoenix, do something like the Phoenix. Nice large drill ship, just so I won't have to worry about resources. I, um, ooh. I like that little cave, that's nice. Well, there's more caves in here than I had realized before. But anyway, yeah, just, uh, my, my idea is eventually I'm going to build a nice large drill ship. Where's my, where's my winter retreat? That's over here. Nice large drill ship, um, just to collect some resources, but I also want it to be enough that I can use it to move. Like I said, once I decide to leave this spot, find a new place to make home. I think the first thing I'm going to do, though, is improve <laughs> this drill ship. It bounces around like crazy. Um... Oh yeah. For this, I use remote control. Come on, let go. There we go. So. As you see, it slides around everywhere. It's uh, it's not a tunnel air. What is that floating out there? I may have to go look at that later. Yeah, it's not a tunnel air. It's, uh, it's just for a surface. How does... But, but watch this bounce around. <laughs> I just, I really need to put a lot more thrusters on here and some more, uh, some more reactors. Luckily, nothing's broke on it yet. Yet. Mind you. This thing's just so pitiful compared to the other things in here. So. That, so far, has been my NID experience, which isn't bad. Um, I just, I feel a little bit behind so far. Everybody else has been on here for a while. Actually, I'm just now noticing I'm heavily overloaded, even with the most basic thrusters. So maybe that might help a bit more if I add another reactor on here. Let's go ahead and park this bad boy. Yeah. I should have some resources now, as I had a bunch earlier. Okay. Yeah, there we go. I mean, that's not a lot, but it's enough really to get me started. So yeah, that's the Nordic Retreat, and this is the NID server. Uh, I'd just like to say again, I'm sorry about the low frame rates. I know it's, I know it's terrible. But uh, sometime in the near future, I should be getting a new machine. Um, and if that's the case, hopefully I'll be able to record at at least 30 frames per second. Right now I'm dropping down to around 20, uh, sometimes even lower when I look up here. <laughs> but there's so much over there. I'd love to show you, but I really can't with this machine. So, well, thanks for watching. Um, leave a comment down below if you have any suggestions, and I'll see you next time.